so I kind of messed up on my eyebrows, but I had to like go in and clean them up just a little bit. Like, just kind of clean it up. Sometimes I have good days, sometimes I have bad days on my brows. Today is a bad day, but it's all right. To go back in and fix it up. I'm gonna do like a a purple or something. I don't think I ever had like purple eyeshadow on, so I'm gonna do like a purple. Mm. And today I'm using Juvia's Place. I'm using the concealer. This is number six. And I'm using the um foundation Team Tanzania, which is number two oh five. Oh, that's pretty. I've never done purple. So. And this is the purple from the crayon case. I'm using her matte book. And I'm going to use, let's see if I can get any. I'm going to use this purple, these two purples. And I'm probably going to add in that little plum color. That shows up so pretty. That's so pretty. I love to use this Tarte Shape Tape. The Fair Neutral one. Just to make the um, colors pop more. The eyeshadows. I'm going to go in. This is what I use when I'm trying to make my cut crease. Let's see. I just go in. And then just like go in. Put a little bit more because it's not even on the same sides. Mm. 
I'm gonna go in with this um this plum looking color and put it on the right on the top of where I put the little let's see how it makes that pop. Ooh it just makes the pigments and the shadows pop just a little bit more. Apply it all over like so. This is really pretty. Oh my god. Okay. That really makes a difference when you put the Some shape tape under it. Then I'm gonna go back in with the dark purple and gently fill it back in like so. I'm gonna go back in with the light purple too. Bring it back out as well. Ooh. Let's see how it's coming up. Oh my god. This is actually pretty. I want to use some of her on her own highlighter from the crayon case and just kind of apply it up there just a little gold on top of that really light purple Also in the corner right here with the same cup with the same highlighter. Ooh, that is so pretty. I'm gonna take my little my little black. Blender brush. Put this same concealer that I use to clean up my brows, the Juvia's Place. I'm gonna clean up my eyeshadow. Clean my eyeshadow up with the tip of my blender brush. I go in. Clean everything all up. has a nice and clean look.
And then I was like, gives me a nice clean look around my eyes. My eyeshadow is not everywhere anymore. And with this foundation, a little goes a long way. So I'm gonna put like a little dab. And I just I always just use like a little dab. And it don't take that much. coverage with this foundation my brows look a mess today I don't know why my brows is coming out like this but I'm going to try to fix them up oh my god You ain't gotta put all that in there. No. <laughs> I'm going to contour my face just a tad bit, just a tad bit. And I'm gonna use uh, Supa's contour palette from the um, crayon case. And I'm gonna take the color Bobby, which is the darkest one on there, and go in and highlight my cheek, under my cheekbone. Just do it. Do the other side. Like so. And then use kind of put it on my cheeks. And then go in with some pink me just a little bit and dab her on there. And put some um trophy on top of that honor roll that I just put in the corner of my eyelid to make it pop. I really want it to pop. Here we go. I'm coming. I'm coming. Hold on. Baby rushing me y'all. I was supposed to be going out to lunch, but then I decided to make a video real quick. Well, it's going to have to be like, I don't know, crunch or something. Because I decided to get on here and do my makeup. He wasn't even thinking about lunch until I said something about lunch. So... I love this highlighter super. Oh my God. This highlighter gives me life. Dang, and I'm using all of her brushes too. So. For my head. Just 
Stop. You're going to mess up my finger waves. <laughs> okay. My eyebrows are starting to come together a little bit. I still don't like them. Like, the day I decided to do a video, my eyebrows don't want to come out right. I'm going to also take this same color, that trophy. Because I like to shine. I like to be real shiny and glittery. Wiping off my brushes real quick with her um her brush cleaner. This is what I use when I'm just trying to do a quick color change. And, you know, you don't have time to like scrub your brushes and watch them, wash them every time. A little, just go in, scrub it a little bit, and then apply a different color. I'll apply just a quick color, especially when I'm in a rush. I think that's all I'm going to do. I'm going to um, keep it simple with the lips. Since I have such a crazy eyeshadow on, um, I'm going to keep it simple with the lip. So, um, I'm going to use Supa's um, lip liner pencil. The Bare. Let me sharpen it real quick. And I like to I never leave the house with that lip liner. I love putting a little outline around my lip. Like so, and since I said I was keeping it simple, I'm put a gloss on, and I'm gonna use uh Supa's Tokyo Dipping Sauce Gloss, the clear kind from the um crayon case. It's real nice and soft. Just want to go back in with the pencil. Ooh, ah. And um, always, I always use setting spray. Let me get the best setting spray out there. This is my number one go-to setting spray. Um. My also my uh, also my other favorite setting spray. My second option is the um the water primer setting spray from Smashbox. That's a good one too. But this this is like my number one favorite setting spray. I'm gonna go ahead and set my face. Oh wait, oh, oh my god, I forgot to do my eyeliner, y'all. Can't go without no eyeliner, baby. Let me do. My on it real quick. Oh, 
Oh, I almost forgot my eyeliner, y'all. How y'all let me forget my eyeliner? Oh my god. Put my lashes on last after I do a sense breath. Okay. So I'm about to apply my lashes from Enhanced Lashes. My girl, um, she's out of Pensacola, and that's where I get my lashes from. And I'm wearing, I'm putting on Majesties. Got my duo. A thin layer of it on the lash. And I like to let it sit on the lash for a little bit before I put it on my eye. I just like to let them sit just for a little bit till it gets like a little tacky before I put it on my eyelid so it won't be sliding everywhere. I love this brand glue for my eyelashes. Um... Y'all, please stop using hair glue for, um, track glue for, uh, eyelash. That is not what it's for, okay? Let's let that go. Go out and get you some good lash glue, okay? Stop using that, uh, that track glue for lashes. Please. Let's, let's leave that. It's 2020. Let's get some real lash glue. All right. And now I'm about to apply my lashes. But, you know, before I knew how to put these lashes on, it was easier to use the lash applicator, but now I'm so used to it that I don't need it. So now, this is a complete look right here. This is like just a little dibble dab. Ooh. God, let me hurry up because when I get the kind of feeling myself, I procrastinate and he hungry. So let me hurry up. All right, let me go get my weed and then I'll be good to go. used to go eat some tacos baby i'm gonna be the the baddest up in there eating tacos i'm gonna wear selena today my man be making names for my wigs and so he called this one selena <laughs> selena <laughs> And that completes my look for today. I'm going to throw some hoops on, grab my purse, and I'm going to go eat. This is my first time trying to do makeup and make a video. Um, so it might be a little ghetto or a little bootleg or whatever, but hey, practice makes perfect. Where we headed, babe? <laughs> I don't know. Follow him. Follow him to get some taco. <sighs> so ready to eat. I'm so 
hungry. It took me like two hours to do my makeup and get get my life together. No way to get some tacos. This shadow is low key popping. Oh, look at that light kitchen. Ooh, kitchen is so light. Some wine. Oh yeah, that's what we need. We need to get some wine. <laughs> this video was all kind of messed up because it was shaking and everything. Good. I'm finna put 